Hey everyone, it's Eric, and today I'm finally getting around to talking about the Little Debbie collection from Goose Creek. It's Little Debbie, <laughs> not Little Debbie. There are 12 candles in this collection, and the first day that I saw these candles out, I just had to get them. I just thought they looked so cute. I didn't even care what they smelled like, so that's really good marketing on Goose Creek's part because I bought them solely on the fact that the jar styles are adorable. And I don't know about you if you have purchased some of these Little Debbie uh, candles, but I did go to the store and I, I did buy some Little Debbies, so they got me there too. Tonight, everyone in the audience has the opportunity to go out and buy some Little Debbie snack cakes. I did buy some of these um, peanut butter cream pies. These are delicious. These are not in the candles, but um, those are really good. And then I also wanted to try these uh, pumpkin spice rolls. So I did pick up those from Little Debbie. So very good marketing strategy uh, from both these companies, really. So there are 12 candles in this collection. Of the 12, there is one that really, really stands out to me as being a little bit above the rest of them. Wow, this is very exciting because we're dealing with foodie candles. All of them are sweet or sugary smelling and you know, you're dealing with all these kind of like bakery sugary scents. But there is one that I felt like really kind of stood out above them and that is the oatmeal cream pies. This one really just stands a little bit above the rest. This is your baked oats, creamy vanilla, warm molasses and soft spices. So to me, you really do get the oatmeal cookie and there is some of that molasses going on in there. It smells really, really good, you guys. This smells pretty spot on to the oatmeal cream pies, you guys. So they did a good job with this one. Uh, so that one to me, out of all of them, is the one if you're considering which ones to put in your shopping cart, I would recommend putting uh, this one in your shopping cart, you guys. And then the next one up is Honey Buns. I see these at the store all the time. These are the Golden Pastry Warm Cinnamon Icing and Sugary Vanilla Swirl. Yeah, and you do kind of like a honey, sugary scent on these. A little cinnamon. Kind of like a, yeah, a little pastry to it. So not bad. It smells pretty good. Next up is one of my all-time favorite Little Debbie snacks. I get these every year, and these are the Christmas tree cakes. I just love the jar style on this. It's so cute, you guys. This is buttery cake, whipped vanilla, and sweet creamy icing. You get a lot of that vanilla icing, just like they are on those uh, Christmas tree cakes, that sugary kind of waxy vanilla icing that's on these cakes. That's pretty much what I smell on these is the vanilla icing, sweet, sugary vanilla. Really, really good though. Um, and again, like, I just love that jar style. So cute, you guys. This holiday season, make sure you have plenty of Little Debbie snack cakes on hand. You never know who's going to drop in. So this next candle, to me, I think could just be basically the same thing. It's the zebra cakes because your scent notes on zebra cakes are warm vanilla cake, sugar, and whipped vanilla icing. So basically talking the same scent notes again. Yeah, I mean, if there is a difference, it's very, very subtle. Maybe it's not as sugary, but this smells pretty much spot on to the Christmas tree cakes. So if you were looking maybe to not get the entire candle collection you know you might just maybe throw one of those out of your cart I don't know they're very very close though you guys they're very close if not the same candle well I am stunned next up is strawberry shortcake rolls we've had so many strawberry scented candles from Goose Creek this year this is creamy vanilla buttery cake sweet tart and strawberry jam yeah this <laughs> this smells Pretty much like those strawberry cake rolls you know the strawberry and it smells like that kind of that synthetic strawberry that the bakery companies use like the they use that kind of like a synthetic strawberry I don't know flavoring 
and it's very, very sweet, you guys. Uh, a little cakey, so, but it smells good, you guys. I mean, these smell pretty much like you get right out of the packages, so, you know, pretty good. Chocolate snack cakes, oatmeal cream, Swiss cake rolls, banana twins. One after another, there's a little Debbie treat for everybody. Cello wrap for lasting freshness. The next five candles, you guys, are all chocolate scented candles. So of the 12 candles that they did, five of them are chocolate scented candles. So I've grouped them together to make it easier on me to kind of smell differences between them. So the first one up is the fudge rounds. And uh, I will just say real quick that of the five, I kind of feel like this is my least favorite and I'll tell you why in a minute. The scent notes are fudge cookies, rich fudgy cocoa, and chocolate fluff. So you do get the chocolate. Um, I suppose there's supposed to be like a cookie note in here. But to me, that cookie fragrance kind of smells like cardboard. It smells like chocolate and cardboard to me. What? And I have tried and tried and tried to smell something different on this candle. I've you know, put this one to the side and gone to it several hours later and just smelled it on its own. I've tried to smell something sweet vanilla and then this. And no matter what I do, it just smells like chocolate and cardboard to me. <laughs> so I don't know. Maybe it'll smell different once I burn this candle. But I think of the group of the 12, this is my least favorite candle. I'm stunned. <laughs> just stunned. Uh, next up is the Nutty Buddy. My mother used to put these in my lunches as a kid. These are your toasted wafers, vanilla cream, and warm sugary peanut butter. So you get the chocolate. Yeah, there's kind of like a wafery smell to it, I suppose. The peanut butter is pretty light though, you guys. You really kind of have to think about peanut butter to smell it. I wish the peanut butter was stronger in this candle because I, I remember these having a pretty strong peanut butter fragrance uh, in the actual Nutty Buddies. So not bad, just wish the peanut butter was slightly stronger on that. And now we have the classic Swiss Rolls. Little Debbie Swiss Rolls. I just love the packaging on this one, so like nostalgic. This is your whipped vanilla cream, warm chocolate, and milk chocolate cake. So this one actually does smell like chocolate cake. It's real kind of cakey. There's the milk chocolate fragrance. I really do like the uh, Swiss rolls. They did a good job on the Swiss rolls. Very, very yummy smelling to me. That one has a good chocolate fragrance. Next up is Cosmic Brownies. The Cosmic Brownies, the stars would align when they came to the party in 1999. A rich, chewy brownie with stellar fudge icing and cosmic candy. Oh, dude, so enticing. Everybody loves the brownies we make. And this is your sweet chocolate fudge brownies and candied chocolate. This one has like a fudgier chocolate fragrance to it. Kind of like a deeper chocolate scent. Kind of what I expected the uh, fudge rounds to have, but this to me is actually fudgier without that cardboard fragrance. So I do like the Cosmic Brownies. And then the last of the chocolate candles is this Christmas Tree Brownies. Again, really cute with the uh, Christmas packaging here. Yep, ho, ho, ho. This one is warm fudge brownies, whipped chocolate, and candied chocolate. This one smells pretty good too. This one smells very, very similar to the Cosmic Brownies. Like they, they pretty much smell pretty identical, you guys. You know, you have that fudgy brownie scent. It smells really, really good. I just kind of feel like it's basically the same thing as the Cosmic Brownies. And then we have Pumpkin Delights. I almost bought some of these the other day at the store. I've never actually tried these. And every time I go to buy them, I look at the packaging and think to myself, gosh, they look too gooey, and I pass. So these are warm spices, sweet pumpkin, vanilla cream, pastry, and soft cinnamon. You get a lot of that pumpkin spice scent note on these. There is something else in there, almost like a... 
like a apple jelly or some kind of like gooey jelly smell to it. I'm not sure what that is. But yeah, you do get a lot of pumpkin spices. It's sweet, very, very sweet. All of these are pretty sweet smelling candles. How sweet, how incredibly sweet. Not bad, not bad. Uh, the last one, fall party cakes. Just really cute jar styles, you guys. This is baked buttery cake, creamy vanilla, and gentle fall spices. Gentle fall spices. I'm glad they went with the gentle fall spices because I don't really care for the mean, angry fall spices. <laughs> Some of these set notes, you guys. It's hilarious. <laughs> it smells okay. Um, I think I prefer the pumpkin delights over this uh, fall party cake. It kind of has that... Uh, cardboard smell in it again like I smelled in the fudge rounds. Huh? Wait. Yeah, I'm not a super big fan of this one either. So I think of the 12, my two least favorite would be uh, these two, the fudge rounds and this fall party cakes. Um, to me, I, I could pass on those as far as burning the candles. Um, the jar styles are adorable. And then my favorites, like I said, that um, oatmeal cream pies is really nice. The Swiss rolls is really good. And I also like the uh, Christmas tree cakes and the honey buns. I think those are some of the more notable ones in the group uh, worth checking out. If you have any of these Little Debbie candles, please leave comments down below. Tell me what you think of them, if you've burned them, what have your experiences been with these candles. And as always, please hit that subscribe button and I'll see you later. Bye-bye. Your love for Little Debbie is something you never outgrow.